Hi, so here is secret solution number two. Again, I'll do a video on how to make this. But on this one, because I was making it for the video, what I did was increase the chlorophyll content. So there's about twice as much chlorophyll in there as there was in the previous one, which is here. So I remade the solar cell using the um, improved one with the greater chlorophyll content. And as you can see, it's now at 76.2. It's dropping, but it's at 76, whereas previously it was at 40. Now, if I plug it in, see there's a much quicker response. Look at that, it's whizzing back up. This time much, much quicker than the previous one did. If I plug it, unplug it again, you'll see it drop down much quicker. Okay, so what that's suggesting to me, and should be suggesting to you, I guess, is that it's the chlorophyll that's actually responsible for the effect that we're seeing. It's increased the chlorophyll content, quicker response, goes up much higher, and uh, drops much quicker as well. Anyway, I thought I'd update you on that because I thought that really was cool as well. I'm going to try and put more chlorophyll into that, obviously, to see what happens. So I hope that was of interest to you, and thank you very much for watching.